Wait, what's going on there? <laughs> so aggressive. Hey, what's going on? Nice to meet you. I'm the theme park falcon. You might be familiar with the with the flea market falcon. Well, I'm the clone of the of the uh, flea market falcon's cousin. We both retain similar memories. We can both morph into human form anytime we want. I'm with Michael right here. We are going to Universal Studios. Yeah. There she is. So I can't wait to go on the Velocicoaster. I haven't been on it yet. I haven't been to Universal Studios in two years. So this should be a fun time. So me being the theme park falcon, what I usually do is I soar high in the air and I look for, for fun and then I, and then I swoop in and scoop up the enjoyment. But sometimes I also make people drive me. The famous universal globe right there. Very nice, beautiful day, about 72 degrees, perfect. So we're in Universal Studios. The first thing I want to show off is over here, the Studio Audience Center. They show films that were shot here at Universal Studios. Two of my all-time favorites, Bring It On 4 and Ace Ventura Pet Detective Jr. The Born Stuntacular. That used to be Terminator 2 the last time I was here. That's kind of sad that it changed, but maybe it's good. Have you seen it? Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, I thought it was really good. Oh, good, good, good. And I've never seen a porn movie. It's pretty good. So a cool thing, if you're a Universal Studios pass holder, you get a free pin monthly. No, you don't. You don't? No, you don't. What happens? It's, that's been discontinued. It's been discontinued. Oh no. Did you say the lounge might close? Uh, no, it was supposed to close December 31st, but they renewed it. So it'll be here for a while. We just don't have the buttons at the moment. Okay, but you might get them back. Hopefully, potentially. We're just kind of waiting to see what they do for this year. Okay, yeah. thank you. Of course. So they don't have the buttons at the moment and no actual news if they're going to be getting them back. That stinks, but what can you do? The NBC Media Center. What's actually pretty neat is uh, they used to have it so you could go in there and you could watch television show pilots and you would get paid money for your time. I think it was like a $30 gift card. And yeah, that's awesome. You use the gift card in the park and for an hour of your time. Because of COVID, I don't even know if they operate anymore. Hey, Doc. Hey, guys. How are we doing? Good, good, good. Nice. Oh yeah, if that's alright. Just a headshot? Oh yeah. Headshot? <laughs> no, they get it, get it. Yeah, I guess he doesn't have a body. Uh, He'll get it, that's hilarious. No, oh, body to put in the car, you put it on the main car. Here we are at the Mummy Ride. Have to get in on this one. It's gonna be closing for at least six months or so for refurbishment. Rumor has it they're gonna be taking Brandon Fraser out of the ride. Do you think that's true? So we just rode that twice. The line is an hour long, but single rider is just walk on. So we got to do it in the span of 10 minutes, rode it twice. It's awesome. So Mike, uh, it's, it's kind of weird they might get rid of Brandon Fraser, but I can kind of see why because like he's a, he's a diva he, He's like yelling about not having a cup of coffee 
is that really professional? You can see why they might be mad and want to uh, maybe get, uh, take them out of the ride. Absolutely. Do you think they would have just edited that part of the ride uh, to begin with? They have an animal show and an animal that can This is Safari. Watch your hands. Oh, oh no. like she's a big fan. Yeah, you're, you're still oh, working at me. Okay, I can die. Okay, perfect. It's really I got I got a quiz. She was well, like, oh, what's my name? That's your real name. No, my name. Shaggy, of course. Oh. It's a fun ride. Would love to get some sweet footage on that. Unfortunately, on a lot of these roller coasters, they make you put your stuff in a locker first and there's metal detectors. There it is, the Velocicoaster. Looks pretty sick, goes over the water. This ride right here, the Jurassic Park, the Rana Don Flyers, whatever the heck the name of it is, I don't ever remember. But what's funny is you can't ride that as an adult. You have to have a kid with you. So if anyone out there has a child, they don't need for for a half hour. Or so let me borrow it. I'll go on the Tarana Don Ding Dong Flyers over there, and I'll get to check that off my bucket list. Looks awesome. Just got off the ride. It was really good. I finally know what it feels like to be a raptor riding a roller coaster. It's a launch coaster, it has two launches. And oh man, every time I launch on a coaster, I feel like I'm gonna have a heart attack in the very best way possible. So it's jam packed now. Unfortunately, we won't be able to go on Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventures. The line is just way too long. Now I've never seen it go out of the ride like that. All the way back here, all the way back here. Here's the end of the line. I spoke too soon. The line keeps going all the way back here. All the way back here. Oh my gosh. I swear, sometimes the fountain talks to me. I'm not crazy. That's gonna do it for today's video. Luckily, we left plenty more for future videos, plenty more parks to go to. I'm the theme park falcon swooping in to scoop up some giggles.